Peter, do you think that, uh, just, just picking up from that kind of revolutionary in the hills, do you think that did shape the kind of romantic love for the, the, the man in the years after? People wanted to believe it. Much of it was a myth from the start. Batista was really overthrown by the Americans who withdrew arms supplies from him and then told him quite clearly that he had to quit and engineered a, what was effectively a military putsch against him. Castro simply moved into the vacuum that was left by Batista's collapse. And the interesting thing about that is how pitifully small Castro's band of, of guerrillas turns out to have been. And we, have, we now have actual warrant for that. And yet he uses expressions such as Moses coming down from the mountain. Well, what, what comes over people? It's like <laughs> it's, it's debutants swooning. Uh, it, uh, over, over big hairy men. It's pathetic. Why do people that, want to swoon over? over well, over he was a young people? guy, and it, it well, maybe, okay, maybe well, he no, sounded that's, like it's, a it's, it's ju it, it is just one but, of those strange things which people seem to want but to Kelly, believe in, in in great leaders and great men. You were a swooner, weren't you? You definitely swooned. Can I, I read you some stuff? You put a letter, your your name to a letter in the Guardian about eleven years ago. There has been not a single case of disappearance torture or extrajudicial execution since 1959 in Cuba. Do you, is that really true? Well, those were the figures we obtained uh, what, what, before what, I signed that letter. What, but what instead, of, instead of starting on that, why don't we start with what Cuba was before the revolution? It was effectively an American brothel run by the mafia, seen as an American colony, and the Cuban revolutionaries partially because the Americans withdrew support from the dictator, organized more and more support. It wasn't just 200 people. The July the 26th movement became a huge mass movement and got rid of that. And the reason for the support Castro enjoyed was largely because people didn't want to go back being what they were, an American right. colony. Right. So that is the key thing to understand. So like all revolutions, they kill the one king, and then they have to build something in they its place. Want, and they, we're judging they, they, whether they built they, something they good in its place. didn't want to become a Soviet colony. Uh, they, none of them had any idea that, that was going to happen. Castro pretended, or genuinely said, and we still don't really know what the truth is, uh, that he wasn't a communist and that, and that he wasn't going to do this. And yet, very, very quickly, they became a Soviet colony. And they became a Soviet colony in, in which opposition to Castro was treated with the most extraordinary brutality. It may be that, uh, that, that people didn't officially disappear, but I have to say they were certainly tortured. Hugo Massos, who was one of Castro's original comrades in the, and very much a strong opponent of Batista, when he said to Castro, I don't support your turn towards Soviet communism, Castro threw him into prison for 20 years, 16 of them in solitary confinement, and arranged for him to be tortured. Massos' <laughs> own account of this... Terrible, right, no, wait, I have to finish there, because yeah. the torture issues here. Massos' own account of this says that he, his genitals were pierced uh, during his imprisonment. Now, that's, if that's not torture, I don't know what is. Do, do you accept broadly that it was awful, that there was extended solitary confinement, denial of medical yes, care yes, to sick I people, summary that. trials, labour yeah. camps, gay people sent for re-education to camps? Well, hang on, one at a time. Right. Well, why one well, is well, well, I mean, no, no, they, 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 they go together or they don't, well, don't no, they? I don't on. deny that. No, and okay. I think the way gay people were uh, treated was appalling. And I think the way in which political prisoners at that time were treated was not but great you either. But, but, but if Mike Pence did that in the United States, you know, if Mike Pence in Indiana had been sending... Maybe you would be the first complaining and protesting, wouldn't you? And saying this man is a monster. Yeah, but I would also see which side I'm on. I'm this not on the... Yes, of course. Yes, right. I, I was on the side and am on the side of what the best things that revolution has done. I don't deny that at all. Of course it's not flawless. They made a huge number of mistakes and they, many of them admit it. And it wasn't... A, they never pretended they were a democracy. It was essentially a revolutionary dictatorship. I would say that these dictatorships are social dictatorships which do a great deal for their people on health, on but, education... But, and you just admitted all this stuff. Hang on a second. Look, yeah. here, here is, first of all, Castro did talk about representative democracy when he, he, did, he, when he first came in the early days. Yeah. And then he simply... He, and I think Got he said Uruzia was an elected president. But he, he, so he did say that. He did make promises yes. of that kind. Most people believe that he would be 
actually <coughs> a, a, a running a freer government than the Batista government. In fact, it was worse than that. You're I a, don't you're, think... You're, 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 uh, Peter, you're going uh, over Tarek, the top. Tarek, it was I, not worse than that. If it well, would, had been worse than well, that, he would have been toppled. And when the Americans uh, invaded him at the Bay of Pigs, why wasn't there a mass uprising, which the Cuban emigres had promised the Americans? Well, the, no it, mass uprising. There's, there's, there's a huge difference between, between being discontented by regime and taking part in a mass uprising. Well, the point about you, Tarek, is you're, you're an intelligent, generous, <laughs> thoughtful person with a sense of humor and a sense of proportion, but you will not make the step of saying, look, whatever good this regime may or may not have done, and I have yes. to say it's questionable whether it did. Any the, good at all. You don't believe it did any right, good. I, I, I say it's but, questionable whether it I haven't finished. I haven't finished the question I was going to ask, uh, ask you, as you well know. Very briefly, as, quick, as quick, you quick, well quick, know, quick. The, it, the actions of Castro towards his opposition were indefensible. Torture, of forcing people to eat their own excrement, the, locking wait, people wait, wait, up for okay, 20 so years for disagreeing with him. This I want Tarek to have the bounds Tarek of civilized behavior. Time to, to Can't answer. Be. Because but Pinochet did a lot of those things. And you don't have to say, well, for all his faults, he did. Hang on, Pinochet he, he had, wiped he had, out 30,000 people, for God's sake. How the, can the, you compare Pinochet no, no, to the, Castro? The, the, but why did you mention Pinochet? Because Pinochet. it's about, about which, wh because how you, which government supported Pinochet. But is it because it's the side you're on that dictates you're willing to forgive all the stuff that you admitted you did? I'm saying that the Cuban Revolution... Well, there are people who say the same about Pinochet, isn't it? Well, he managed no, to develop... No, I don't think people say Chile. exactly... Even Pinochet's admirers don't say the same things about him, by the way. They now accept what he did, and Chile is doing what it's doing to obliterate that legacy, which was backed by the West. But can, why can, can't you, can, can't you, you, you get, just recognise... This, 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 this enormous rage you get into about Pinochet's killing, but what about Castro's... Judicial murders, the show trials, the shootings, the we, repeated firing squads at the La Cabana during the first months of his of, of his time in power. Utterly lawless. Hang on, utterly, uh, Tarek, uh, Tarek Ali, you must have the last word. Give Tarek the last word. I want Tarek to have the last word. The Cubans made a revolution. Tarek, the Cubans made a revolution. The Americans tried to stop it. The Americans punished them for nationalizing all the big American companies and liberating their country socially and economically. That they made mistakes, we know. But you know, the mistakes made by people, huge dictators in South America and mistakes elsewhere, made. who back, backed by the United you States. Use the word, you use the word mistakes were made in a sort of passive way. These were things that were worse than anything the United States. Look, the worst in, of in, anything in the United recently, States. listen, yeah. the worst of anything recently be, has been the torture at Guantanamo, which is based in Cuba, and that torture has been carried out by who? But what? But what? But what, who? what, what but, use, you know, what, I'm just what, saying. What, what uses that as an argument? It, the question, the, the point is, you object to it quite rightly. Because yeah. You, because quite rightly. No, I object to as, whoever as I tortures. Do, you object to all torture. Yes. But you don't actually seem to object to it half so much when Castro does. No, it. Well, I, I object to that it. Seems to I me know. To be a, a lack this is of not true. I object to it, but I say when discussing not the enough. Cuban Revolution. When discussing the Cuban Revolution, one has to discuss a great deal and not be completely captured by ideology. Is there anything because that excuses torture? No. Right. Well, then, then why, why do you excuse, well, it? Well, I do excuse it when Castro does it? We need to leave it there, gents. Thanks both uh, very much.